Hello everyone, just wanted to make a video for those who are trying to get the In The Cards event challenge done relatively quickly. It's where you complete contender and platinum cards. For this, you're just going to be focusing on the contender cards. So for which one you want, head on over to Eva Levante and you'll pick up the Vanguard playlist card. This will give you one of three different kinds, and the ones you want are Umbral Contender or Galvanic Contender, as both of those require Void, Final Blows, and Strikes, which is perfect because we're going to be running an all Void build. So I'm on Void Warlock, my super, I'm using Cataclysm for my abilities. The only one that matters is Vortex Grenade, so make sure you have that. For your aspects, you want Feed the Void so you can get Devour and Chaos Accelerant to make your grenades a little bit better. Your fragments, you want Echo of Remnants to increase the duration of your grenades, Echo of Instability so your grenades give you volatile rounds, and Echo of Undermining so your grenades weaken targets. Your weapons, your kinetic is mostly just going to be for stunning champions, so I used conditional finality for the overloads, or unstops. If you don't have conditional, you could use something like Bastion or Malfeasance. If you don't want to use either of those, could use a scout rifle, the unstoppable scout rifle mod. For your energy weapons, any void SMG is good. I'm using Hero's Burden because destabilizing rounds goes with volatile flow, which is what we're going to be abusing for all of this. But if you have funnel web, it works too, just any void SMG. If you're heavy, you want a machine gun, as long as it's void. Any one map, but or doesn't matter which one, just has to be void. For your artifact, um, you want the Authorized Void perk, so all of your Void mods are discounted. Volatile Flow, obviously, and Bricks from Beyond. For your Armor, I'd recommend Controverse Hold. I am not using it because I don't have a good one, and I don't really want to pull one from Collections, so I'm using Nezarex Sin instead. Um, but for your mods, Void Siphon mods and Heavy Ammo Finder on your helmet. I use triple void loader for the gauntlets. Um, for chest armor, concussive dampener and some elemental damage resistance mods. For your boots, triple void weapon surge. And for your class item, uh, double time dilation just so we can have that weapon surge for a little bit longer. Now with your build out of the way, all you need to do is go into the competitive strike playlist solo by going into the non-match made mode. So I'll let one of my attempts play for the remainder of the video and hopefully some of you find this useful. Shadow Legion units are shifting their attention to the Cloud Arc. That's likely why Neo Moon's defense systems are reading offline. But I bet those Vex pumps are also poking too close to the city's internals.
light? The Shadow Legion are forcing Bacon into that Vex pocket. The Vex net uses similar gateways as the Cloud Arc, which means they could infiltrate the network and gain access to the veil. Bacon are relentless, especially under the Witness's control. We need to get in there and stop them. <laughs> 